Bruh. Bruh. What the hell? <laughs> Super! <laughs> Yo, he better do that shit. I swear to God. God damn it. That was just... I now now I definitely don't see Nekomaru dying without a doubt. That motherfucker came back from the rivers of hell, literally, with a mechanical body. Obtained a nurse apron. Fuck this shit. I miss Mekon already, dude. I really do. I hate you, Monokuma, with all my goddamn heart. So Mekon even slit her throat. Oh my god, Mekon's ruthless. What the fuck? We were hoping things would progress smoothly. That's right. A common ordinary progression would have been just fine. Like for example, the enemy's lair crumbling right after you defeat the final boss, or your dead friend suddenly reappearing, just like in freaking Dragon Age Origins. <gasps> but I shall not spoil that. It would have been just fine if things had progressed like that. That's the kind of old-school progression we were hoping for. Not this unreasonable turn of events. And there it is again. I've been reborn in the rivers of hell. See, the quest See, the thing is, is that... He got... His upper torso is the one that got completely obliterated. It got... Obliterated, his upper torso. So does he still have his lower body? Like real talk. Or did they replace everything part every part of his body? Just like Frankie did, bruh. Super I really want him to say it, dude. I really do. Mekomaru? Is that you? <laughs> virus Mecha Maru. That is bootleg, Virus. You deserve that one. <laughs> <laughs> no matter how you look at it, I'm still me. No, you're not. Bro, you got a fucking how do you- do you even sleep? Or is it like a button that you press? No matter how we look at it, this isn't you at all. Oh my fucking god, it's- Dude, he looks... Kinda cool. From this- from this point of- from this perspective, he looks actually like a badass, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. Jeez, you guys are a strange lot. You all have such big wide eyes. What? Oh my god. He's smiling. He still has his he still have his jaw, or maybe it's not even his jaw, it's just his fucking his uh maybe okay, never mind. It is probably just his lower part of his skull. Because I don't okay, never mind. I don't I don't fucking I, I don't I have no explanation for what the hell is going on anymore. <laughs> Nakamaru, dude, I miss your actual skin, not this metallic fucking looking thing. I already know what you want to say just by looking in your eyes. Then again, I am a I am a former team manager. Former? Huh? What happened? You look like you've seen a ghost or something. Bro, we've seen something worse. We've seen you come back from hell with a mechanical ass body. Hey man, don't go scarring Miss Sonya with that strange ass mask. As he raised his stammering voice, Kazuichi grabbed on to Nekomaru's head and... Come on, take it off! <laughs> ow, ow! Ow! Stop it! <laughs> Bruh. What is going on in this fucking game? Hey, hey! I wanna come off! Wait, what? Are you freaking kidding me? It's not just for show, and we get this scenery again. Nice. This is so thumbnail material. Pure electricity. What? It's not just for show, it's pure electricity. I've been reborn as pure electricity. <laughs> Holy sh- Holy fucking shit. This is insane. <laughs> if you're seriously Nekomaru, that's my fault, right? You ended up getting a body like that, and it's all my fault, right? S sorry. Wow. Different, different pose. Different pose. I like it. I really do. Sorry, Nekomaru. I, I don't know how to apologize for this. <laughs> it sounds like Ed from freaking uh, Ed and Eddie. Don't worry about it. A lot of stuff happens when you're alive. 
You serious? There's two upbeat. Is this really okay? <laughs> <laughs> if you keep sweating the small stuff, you're going to end up getting more gray hairs. Hey, hey. Commenting on every little thing he does is a waste of time. Hey. But you're really Nekomaru, right? You came back for us, right? That's right! I resurrected from the depths of hell in shining silver! Interesting. Yeah. How, how are you even okay with that? It doesn't even compare to my eye patch. That is true. How can you accept that body? Oh. It's better to just be alive. That is true, too. Huh? 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 It's better to just be alive. Hey, don't you agree? If I'm alive, I can still talk to you all. If I'm alive, I can still fight. Show some spirit! It doesn't matter what happens to my body, not one bit. This guy... I love you, Nekomaru. You, 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 you my bro. But Mondo is still my, my, uh, my dude, bro. But you my bro, bro. Bro. <laughs> amazing! You're amazing! Nekomaru is brimming with hope. Get out of here. So hold on. He even... So he lost his whole body. He lost his whole fucking body. Because his feet is not human anymore. Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the robo bro. It's better to just be alive. I do understand what Necromari was saying, but... No matter how he makes sense of this, it's just too weird. This isn't a novel or a movie, this is reality. Can something this unexplainable really be allowed to happen? No, instead. Why did this happen? Um. Anyway, I'm glad that's fine, right? Right? Nekomaru definitely came back to us. What's this? Why am I? Am I interrupting your touching reunion? Can I wish Monokuma could fucking go away. You're the reason why Mikon died, bruh. Real talk. <laughs> you too! I fucking- ah. Oh! I'm getting sleepy, sorry, but I think I'm going to have to call it a night. Aww, alright, Amber. Thanks for staying up as long as you did. Hopefully I can see you next time. Have a great night. Yeah. Why is Nakamaru a robot? Hey, um... He's super! That's what he is. Unfortunately, it was truly difficult to save Nakamaru from the jaws of death. But they don't call me the Psycho Pop Magician for nothing. What? Oh my goodness! So oh my goodness! Before and after has occurred. <laughs> it appears to be a little too dramatic. Thanks to that, I'm getting stabbed by all these envious stares. Hey, hey, hey! If you're really a robot, what's going on with your thought process? Is that a program too? Then what happened to the other stuff, like your self-awareness and? <laughs> Fool! How many times do I have to tell you that it doesn't matter? It kind of does, dude. No matter what shape or form I take, I am Necromaru Nidai! Is he? <laughs> Is he going to power through the rest of his life with his new abilities? Bruh. Bruh, wait. How is he gonna have kids? Hmm. That kind of reaction, it looks like you really are self aware. <gasps> that means this technology is insane! I've never seen or heard anything like this before. Here. Not gonna lie, I expected um Soda to get all hyped up about his body. What the commoner co uh, what the fuck? What the commoner considers advanced is not much of an advancement. If you think advancements exist in colleges and laboratories, that's a huge misunderstanding. <laughs> the real advancements exist in the place where you can pass on that talent. Ooh, interesting. Hey, hey. And you're saying that's you? Were you really that amazing? You. Stop admiring him. You stupid stuffed toy! Don't go screwing with people's body like that! What? Hold on, if you harm Monokuma, you're going to... <laughs> Ooh, that's new. If you intend to defy me yet again, you're quite the barbarian. Disappear! Just... Jeez, this time, you will definitely fall prey to my Monokuma bazooka! Nakamaru! Yes! Once again, the world shook and turned stark white, as if the surrounding environment and all sound was blown away by the impact. 
turning everything completely white. And within that whiteness, I heard that voice yet again. It wasn't me going. Uh, uh, Amaru! Holy shit! Uh, that didn't face me at all! This mother. This dude! <laughs> this dude! <laughs> oh god! Oh my god! Nekomaru, what the f. <laughs> Nekomaru, it's like. It's like because he has his new body, he he is extremely aware how tough it is. Holy shit! Check it out! I'm intact. I have no injuries at all. Yo, who voices Nekomaru, bro? Hey. Somebody look this. Somebody look this up. Are you fucking serious? He took that blast and doesn't even have a single scratch. <gasps> awesome! He's seriously a real robot. Super. <gasps> Hey, can you let me disassemble this dis disassemble? Really? Disassemble you? Can you let me disassemble you and show me your insides? No, thank you. Why is that so hyped? Like <laughs> it's <laughs> If I get disassembled, I'll end up dying. Interesting. By the way, ah, I suppose I should fill you in. Even though he's a robot now, if Nakamaru is killed, it's still going to count as a murder, okay? Of course. Of course. It's possible that Negamaro might kill someone instead because he's a robot. <laughs> Don't say such foolish things. That will never happen. <laughs> well, with all that in mind, you guys enjoy the killing school trip together. Let's get along. Once again, I hope we can all get along. Honestly, I'll be kind of. How the f does he even sleep? It's impossible. It's impossible. It's gonna be a while before I can mentally process this. Um. Um. Well, Nakamaru never returned to his original form. If that is the case, it is a burden for Nakamaru. Yeah, I miss his manly ass pecs, bro. Hey, hey, it's not like I came back as a monster. I'm just a robot now, you know. I'm sorry, I can't really see a difference. That's fucked up. Uh -huh. Well, consider <laughs> just consider this a little promotion. By making a robot one of the main characters, a genuine mystery is transformed into a sci-fi mystery. Does he have lasers? At the hard-boiled, whoops, my uh, laptop's going dark. Holy shit! And the hard-boiled is transformed into cyberpunk. <laughs> You're totally destroying the genres. Oh well, who cares? As long as it's fun, it's totally fine. <laughs> as I listened to Monokuma's boasterous laugh, once again I was forced to accept. This island is not the day-to-day -day world I know. It's a mad world. Mad world. Where the strange is accepted as normal. This is, just, this is not even strange. This is just... Advanced strangeness. I don't fucking know. This is really weird. Causes, reasonings, circumstances, foreshadowing. These things don't apply here at all. That's what it means to live in a mad world. We're in chapter 4 already? I didn't find every Monokuma, sadly. Do ultimate robots dream of clockwork? Clockwork the, uh... The fucking FGC guy? <laughs> the next morning, we gathered at the hotel restaurant like we always do. Man, I don't know who I want to fucking chill with now. I kind of want to chill with uh, Chiaki now. Man, the food today was awesome as usual. As usual, you sure do eat a lot. I feel relaxed just by looking at you. Oh, Lord. Oh, no. The fucking... The uh, I don't even do. Can we just get rid of the skulls? The basically the memorial for Mihiru is still there by Hyoko. God damn it, Mikan! It's impossible not to worry about it. No matter what, this feels really strange. It's not something I'll get used to to uh, used to easily. Hey hey. Anyway, what are you gonna do, M Mecha Maru? What? Uh, what? So, when Virus said that shit, it's actually a word in here? Mecha Maru. Mecha Maru, huh? Okay. 
Mechamaru. Ugh. Mechamaru. You're used to him already? Oh, I'm glad that the, uh, the, his name, his liter his, uh, name to the left didn't change to Mechamaru Nidai. <laughs> what am I going to do? Mm. For food. Do you need, like, oil? Hey, hey. Regular? Premium? Well... No, he doesn't need oil, since he is... He said he's pure electricity. Maybe he's battery powder or something. <laughs> I can totally eat no more food, especially rice dishes. I can't keep my eyes off them. However, I've been feeling a little down today, so I don't have much of an appetite. Right. Are you malfunctioning? If you show me your insides, I can fix you up, you know. True. No, Mitch, no! <laughs> <laughs> what? You're s what? So are you here too? Wow, he really doesn't like, um, Nagito. Sorry. I'm sorry. I should have know my place. I should know my place and not speak out of turn when everyone's gathered together like this. However, I just wanted to make sure I spoke to you about what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday? Hmm. That person, Mikon, caught her beloved. I can't help thinking about that. It won't get out of my head. What? Am I just a coward for worrying about that? Let me tell it you. It crossed my this. mind as well. Based on how she praised it, phrased it, I said praised it. So this is the end. Me God, dude! Now I can go to my beloved and be forgiven. I can finally see my beloved. But she, she considers the beloved a they, so it's like, what the fuck? This it was as if she was speaking to an entity that does not exist in this world. Then there's nothing to worry about. More importantly, we should be thinking about the future foundation, our enemy. If that fearsome organization known as World Ender, oh lord, I'm getting hiccups, is truly responsible for our imprisonment. If you flinch, you will die. Then investigating who's behind that organization is our top priority. Yo, Gundam, I hope you survived through all this. Like, real talk, man. I really do. The Future Foundation. Mm. That word, future. Does it have anything to do with that ancient ruin? I mean, there's no doubt that the symbol on the door to the ancient ruin was the Japanese word for future. If that's the case, it might be better if we investigate the ancient ruins again later. However, however, the more I think about it, the less sense it makes. Why would an organization that's secretly plotting to end the world make us suffer like this? They went to a lot of trouble to ab abduct us and bring us to this island. Hmm. Not only that, they took away several years worth of memories of our lives at Hope's Peak Academy. For reasons that are also unknown. Future Foundation, the <laughs> world in the raw, huh? All right. Impossible. There's obviously something wrong with you if you believe in something so unrealistic. Hey, hey. You're one to talk. But, but what we should be most concerned about, it, as it relates to the Future Foundation, isn't that right? Is the traitor from the Future Foundation that's hiding among us? Hey, I wonder who it is. The true identity of the outsider hiding among us and trying to ensnare us. I won't be fooled. Nagito's obviously the most suspicious, though. <laughs> Even a childish organization blathering about ending the world wouldn't accept someone like me. Man, nobody wants a worthless human like me to join their group. <laughs> you guys should know that feeling well, right? You think so? And that's the reason why you're not the traitor. I don't understand your theory at all. Real talk. Huh? Then who do you think is the most suspicious? It's obvious. I nominate Hajit. What the fuck? Well. well, isn't it normal to doubt the most unlikely candidate? Hey. Not just that. 
You're the only one here who still doesn't know what ultimate talent you possess. If we're basing this on an outsider holding or hiding among a group of ultimates, Hajime should be doubted right away. And Hajime's the traitor? Bitch, fuck you! I ain't the traitor! If anyone's the traitor, just by pure luck and guess, it's Sonya. That's what I'm guessing. Of course not! What are you even saying? You shouldn't raise your voice like that. We might become even more suspicious of you, you know. This is this obviously is your fault. Settle down. Stop fighting! Oh lord. <laughs> Don't you think fighting with ourselves like this is Monokuma's trap? That might be true, but I still can't handle that fucking grunt. No. Alright, I'll handle this. Just leave this matter to me! What are you doing? Yeah, what do you mean? To eliminate this tense atmosphere, allow me to present to you my new function that I discovered last night. What? New function? Don't tell me! Is it flight? Can you fly? No! It's not a it's not a con conventional function like that. Sorry, can't read. It's far more practical and novel. <laughs> now then, he's gonna have a he's gonna have shining nipples like a like Frankie. <laughs> what? What? Is he crying? What? What am I looking at? Behold! <laughs> Nakamaru is crying? No. Hardly, I'm not crying. Is that orange juice? What is that? My right eye dispenses cola, and my left eye dispenses Ruabos tea. He is Frankie! <laughs> He's Frankie! Frankie gets powered up by cola, remember that shit? Behold. What am I looking at? <laughs> are you kidding me? What are you, a soda fountain? I know we'll be here all day. We keep commenting on every little thing you do. Don't fuck with me. <laughs> but what the hell was Monokuma thinking giving you a function like that? You're so evil. That guy, he's definitely fooling around. Monokuma's just toying with other people's bodies. <laughs> I too was modified by Monokuma. You just got screwed over. So I totally understand how Nekomaru feels. <laughs> but don't be depressed. You'll get used to it. It's surprisingly... It's surprising how quickly you get used to it. I'll beat you up. Don't go button in our conversation all of a sudden. I'll kill you until you die from it. I'll kill you until you die from it, you stupid rabbit. Okay. That's an extremely violent thing to say to someone. <laughs> you showing up at this time means Did you come tell to tell us that you've defeated another mono beast? Ta da! You're correct, bitch. <laughs> Once again, you can't visit a new island, so please take this opportunity to get along with everyone. I ain't going. What a drag. Huh? Even if we go to the new island, it's not like we're gonna find a way to escape this place, right? You are right. Rather, I feel as though the opportunity to kill increases every time we go to a new island. So it might be best if we do not go. Huh? I renounce you. I thought he was gonna continue to be honest. I don't know what you're planning, Fiend, but we're not going to fall for it. That's that, that it's, that's a misunderstanding. I, I was... Lame. Ah, jeez, how annoying! Unbeal. Just stay back and leave the rest of you, big brother. I'll give you an example of how to lure these guys to you, little sis. Hey. What are you doing? You're acting like we're allies or something. What the fuck is going on? Didn't I tell you to stay back? What? What what am I looking at here? I don't know. What? Is this an anime reference cuz I don't think I seen this shit. <laughs> Is this a raging demon? It spells delicious. 
Oh shit, you're right. Wow, that is bootleg. The delicious demon. Mesops! <laughs> Fucking Akuma. <laughs> there, now that I have mopped up the annoying one. Okay, since you guys are feeling down in the dumps, I'll make you guys so excited your noses will bleed. Kinda don't want that. Compared to the earlier investigations, I've prepared a special treat that com that's completely different than before. Treat? Nice. Oh, you took the bait. I guess it's true. If you want to get a shut-in out, what the fuck? If you want to get a shut-in out of their room, carrots work the best. Huh? Who the fuck cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the treat is. <laughs> it's an amazing treat. Don't wet your pants. Well. It's okay if you do, just don't spray it on me. I prepared a bunch of stuff you guys might find interesting on the new island. Miracle! Such as clues about the future foundation. Interesting. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Such as parts that may be useful for making a ship. You serious? Are you fucking for real? Are you serious? News! Soda's gonna get on that shit instantly, bruh. And also use student profiles from your time at Hope's Peak Academy. Huh? So... so, do your best to explore. Take care! Hey, hey. What should we do? We go to that fucking island. That's what we do. You know, right? Our only option is to go, obviously. We might be able to go home if we have ship parts. Yep. I plan to go too. If there, if there are clues about the future foundation, we need to make sure we see them. Hajime. What about you, Hajime? Of course you're going, right? God damn right I'm going! If you look at your student profile, you might be able to find out what your shining talent is. <laughs> it's a chance for you to clear any suspicions, right? What suspicions? I don't think anyone here had doubt here doubts what? me, sorry. Ah, I see. But if there's a clue about my talent, I want to to know what it is. The reason Hope's Peak Academy chose me. The talent I possess. These things matter to me. There's no way I'm not worried about it. It seems you are prepared yourselves for the worst. Starting to get pumped up. That means we're gonna go, right? Bye. If everyone is going, I shall accompany you as well. <laughs> but there's also a possibility that Monokuma set a trap. We should be careful where we step. I can't stop thinking about that ancient ruin that might hold clues about the future foundation. But we should start exploring the new island. Wow, everyone left instantly. <laughs> it's Mahiru's photos. Hiyoko used them as decoration. But Hiyoko was no longer... No. Not just her. Even Ibuki and Mikan. I will not accept any more victims. I will definitely prevent that from happening. Uh, dude, I was hoping the game was gonna freaking let me look at the photos. Each one of the photos. That would have been amazing. That would have been amazing. Oh, God. I ain't going. I ain't doing this chapter. Fuck this shit. I'm already heartbroken. Mekon, my, like, my friend. Like, my dear, dear friend. Who had a lot of cake, apparently. Is a murderer, and she fucking got she. Her execution is probably the. It's not bad. It's just really fucking lame. <laughs> it's it's really lame. Like Pekko went out with honor, literally. She fucking fought, but it wasn't even her doing. It was Monokuma controlling her, and it didn't. Tatter Tatter went off like he went out really, really crazy. Real talk. Yeah, we end we're ending it here, man. Alright, guys. Like I said, we're ending it here. Thank you guys all so very much who withstood... Or not who withstood. Who stood with me for six fucking hours to do the investigation and do the trial all in one night. Hopefully that shit can happen once again. Um, not, not tomorrow, of course. Tomorrow I might just make social links, but... If I really, really want time to myself, I might stream again Friday and Saturday. Uh next Friday and Saturday. This was an extremely crazy ass fucking trial. And I'm still heartbroken to be honest. Like, 
It was legitly Monokuma's fault that caused Mikan to basically fucking lose control. And then she murdered Hyoko instantly. And Ibuki, definitely. She fucking strangled Ibuki. Yo, Mikan is a- Mikan's a murderer, dude! I'm so goddamn done. God damn it, dude. If I could give you guys a proper send-off, I would, but I'm still working on my intro and my outro. Anyways, dudes, like I said, that's it for tonight. Have a great night. Thanks all you guys who are new to the stream, who stayed here for a long ass time. And yeah, if you guys follow too, thank you guys for that as well. Anyways guys, until then, I'll see you guys in the next stream.